All right, so it's been a very prosperous day for old Max. Um, I got a bunch of cool bobber shit, and I'm gonna show it all to you guys. First off, I got this bobber tire. We got the, uh, the two-stripe white wall thing. It's a brand new tire. Uh, fits the bike, but the only bummer is, is apparently uh, the manufacturer doesn't make a matching front tire. So uh, I'm gonna have to think about what I'm gonna do with it. I'm not so sure that I'm gonna use all this stuff that I got on this bike. But um, currently it's got these two Dunlop matching qualifiers on it, uh, which match and I like that. Um, but we'll just see how it goes. Maybe I'll put it on, maybe I won't. Uh, so basically what happened is I went to uh, um, an ad on Craigslist. This guy was selling this tire for 20 bucks. I bought it, I'm like, well, what else you got? And so for $40 more, I got these three skull cap helmets. Not such a fan of skull caps, but I mean, shit, dude. Price was right for sure. I got all this exhaust wrap, fiberglass exhaust wrap, a couple of springs, two homemade bobber seats, got that one, got this one. It's got springs on it already. What else did I get? Oh, I got these bitchin' pipes. These great pipes. Um, I got this. This is just like a cheapo tail light thing. Um, I don't know if this will make it into the uh, into the project or not. But I mean, it's kind of cool. Maybe it will. This. I pulled off of the uh, uh, the sissy bar that came with this bike. I think it's really cool, and it matches the uh, the bronze thing that I already put on it. So I don't know where I'm gonna put this. You know, maybe it'll do one of these numbers or something. Maybe I'll just hang on to it. I don't know. I just think it's really, really sexy. So we got that. Um, I got some saddlebags, which I'm not going to be using uh, on the bobber, obviously. But I got some saddlebags, and so uh, they're pretty cool. So that was a great deal, just 40 more bucks. Uh, I'm really happy about that. Then today, I went to an antique store and bought one of these old uh, police spotlights. And I just uh, wired in um, a motorcycle bulb in there because the bulb was burned out. Super bright. The thing like rotates. You twist this handle and it rotates, which is neat. And it still works and everything. And <laughs> so I don't know where I'm going to put it on the bike or even if, but I just think it'd be really cool to just have it like. You know, like sitting right down here, you know, and I can rotate it back and forth. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Um, I'm pretty stoked for it. Uh, currently, the tank is sitting for 96 hours because I have it, um, I lined it with Pour 15, which is the only liner that I use. But so it's just sitting and drying because uh, I cleaned it out and now I. So yeah, one other thing was I took all the uh, the fender and um, the tail light and everything off here. Um, right now, what I'm probably going to do is just chop, chop right there. Not going to hard tail it. Not going to do any um, real extensive modifications to it or anything. Just uh, chop that, and then see what I can do about lowering it a little bit. Maybe I'll drop it down an inch or two in the front. Um, so that's a plan for right now.